Hello fellow traders, Marv Eisen here from Timeless Dollar Trading Academy. If you've seen any of my hundreds of videos, you know I teach a trading course teaching six basic trade setups, gap, support and resistance, trend, time and price, momentum and candlestick. And you can rely on these six trade setups exclusively and never mind all the other things that you might know about trade setups. And what's a trade setup? A trade setup is an indication of where prices may go based on a pattern that has been established and historically established in the past. And so those are six trade setups. You also know that I use the Taylor Trading Zone religiously by calculating the Taylor Trading uh, range on the Taylor Trading Calculator that's available on my site at TimelessDollar.com. And the range is accurate on most days. Here's uh, Wednesday, or Tuesday rather, uh, December 2nd. And you can see the range drawn out as a rectangle on my chart. And while the prices didn't trade within the range, if I leave the range alone, I'm going to transpose the range and just to show you, and I'm going to do this on a couple of days to show you that prices generally track within the range. And by transpose the range, you can see that the calculated range for the day is where the price is what limited prices actually. And so let me get rid of this and I'm going to go back. I'm going to go to another day, Wednesday, December 3rd. And of course, the range is the same without even transposing it. I want to mention something that I probably haven't spoken about enough, and that is volatility. Now, we all know that the market is volatile. Take, for example, pre-market. Here's the S&P E-mini pre-market on Tuesday, December 2nd. And notice that, that the length of the candles is relatively even, uniform. There are four points between each horizontal line on this chart to give you a frame of reference. And so as we get into the trading day, notice that the volatility increases. This is a three minute candle. And so with four points between each horizontal line, if you catch the distance in a trade from one horizontal line to the next with one contract, you make $200 for uh, four points, $50 a point, $200. Now you can see that, let's say that most of these candles and, and you can look at them, most of these candles are more than four points. They're eight points, 10 points. Here's a candle that tra traverses went to almost 12 points in one three minute period, 12 points, $50 a point, $600. So these are not small numbers for most traders. And so how much do you have to catch in order to make money? But on the other hand, you can very quickly lose money. So let's talk about this volatility. And I just want to focus on this in this video for today. For volatility, and we're talking about reversals, where is it going to go from low to high or high to low? I use the stochastic. And here's the stochastic down here. I use a relatively fast stochastic 733. And so we can get an indication if prices are going to reverse by an overbought or oversold stochastic. And I'm not going to go into a long explanation of stochastics. It's available online. The stochastics is an oscillator that oscillates between zero and 100. And so where prices are at a low point, let's take this candle right over here. And stochastics indicate that prices are oversold, this would be a good place to get off the trade. Now, greed takes over. If you've gotten on, let's say you're lucky, you got on at 68.56 and you wrote it down to 68.33. So what's that, a 23 point trade? 23 points, great trade. So you're feeling great, you're gonna stay on it. But no, stochastics is oversold. That would be an indication lock up your profits and get out. You can reverse, you can certainly reverse or go the other way, trade from low to high or trade from high to low or both ways. But volatility, and again, the length of the candles, look how volatile trading was on Wednesday, December, on Tuesday, December 2nd, all right? And on Wednesday, December 3rd, there was a pre-market announcement. I think this was the um, ADP employment report. 
as you know, the government, the federal government, is not releasing reports because the current administration doesn't like the economic news that the reports are revealing, so they're withholding those reports. But there are private reporting services like ADP, one of the largest payroll companies, if not the largest in the country. And so the ADP employment report, the, the ADP employment number rather, reported that price that uh, 37,000 jobs were lost, whereas the forecast were, was for 40,000, I think it's 40,000 jobs would be gained. And so that was a, uh, a big hit. The market took a big hit pre-market and went down to the bottom of the Taylor trading range. But again, of course, prices traded up within the range. And you can learn to trade the Taylor trading range, learn to use stochastics as a guide to where prices are going to reverse. You can scalp, you can scalp very well using the Taylor trading zone with the stochastics limiting your losses on the reversals or getting you out before there is a loss. And just take your odds, take your best trades using the stochastics as a guide, overbought or oversold as the case may be, and using the Taylor trading zone as the limit of where prices are going to go for that day. So that's my video for today, Marv Eisen from Timeless Dollar Trading Academy. Trading is certainly not easy, but it's simple. There isn't that much to know. Nobody knows where the market is going to go. However, there are six trade setups. They've, they're reliable, and the reason that they're reliable because they have historical precedent. The Taylor trading range it has been around since the 1950s when George Taylor developed his numbers, and prices trade relatively well within the trading range on almost each and every trading day and in most markets. So that's why I use it religiously. Thanks again for watching. Trade safely. Use lots of patience. Learn to use that stochastic. Practice with it a while if you're not familiar with it. I'll see you in my next video. Marv Eisen for Timeless Dollar Trading Academy.